So a woman was injured after an explosion at her town of Brownville home this morning. Just look at the rubble and damage to the home right here. Officials say that it can no longer be lived in. Tonight we learn what may have caused the blast and neighbors tell 7 News reporter Gage Kilborn what it felt like. Neighbors on Bonnie Road in the town of Brownville heard an explosion. They saw shook their home across the street. I heard this big bang and Literally, I saw a tree landed on my house. It was just so loud. Tracy Hickey was the first person to arrive on the scene after she heard the explosion. Hickey saw cinder blocks blown out of place and the siding damaged as a result. I was just shooken up. Like, I didn't know what to think. Like, I, you know, usually you don't expect things like that, but obviously it does happen. Amanda McConnell was the only person that was in the home during the explosion, which blew her off the ground. Officials say McConnell smelled what she thought to be meat, but may have been propane gas, which they believe is what led to the explosion. According to officials, McConnell grabbed her dog, went into the car, and began backing out of the driveway before going to her neighbors to call for help. She has a laceration to her hand. Um, they've taken her to the hospital to be checked over. As for the home itself, Fire officials say the explosion moved the house 6 to 10 inches off of the foundation, which crunched the front porch and separated the steel plates, which holds together manufactured homes. Jefferson County Deputy Fire Coordinator Willis McIntosh believes that for this reason, the home is not livable. It's probably going to be a total loss. Basically, they'll have to come in and move, remove the home and uh, they're basically sit on a cement pad and then they can just uh, replace it with a new one. In the meantime, the McConnells will be staying at a relative's home. Gage Kilborn, 7 News.